guess the only thing I can say is it's time for us to boldly go where no one has gone before. It's the Star Trek Away Team set. Based on the original series, uh, this is kind of one from us for our friends over at WizKids. We're looking forward to unboxing this. Uh, we're also going to do a video on how we would play sealed packs from what we pull here. So we're going to pull our initial packs, we're going to kind of throw them in a box, randomize them, and in the next episode you can watch it pull sealed. You're also going to do get, get the usual piece-by-piece -piece figure review uh, from us. So we're doing a lot with it, and we're really excited. So uh, shall we boldly go? Or go boldly, as the grammar corrected it to. <laughs> now, I'm really hoping to get a lot of Klingons because I'm a big Klingon kind of guy. Fair. Uh, and, you know, I just hope that today is not a good day to die because I'd rather not be dead right now. All right. So, what do we got? Really? Oh, cool. Um, so, I've got a Klingon back. I've got uh, a Tellerite. Sorry, I don't know how to read. Mr. Scott, a Romulan Legionnaire. And in my rare is Mr. Spock. Seems highly logical. A little bit of a uh, Nimoy action. Yeah, Spock's 100 points. Yeah, let's see what's going on here. Agony Booth. Oh, it's a Mirror Universe Spock. I missed ah. that. Okay, cool. Mirror Universe Spock with the goatee. the costume. And the goatee. You guys will get a better look at that. Yeah. It's a barrier. Okay, neat. Oh, all right, cool. Good start then. <laughs> all right. Something new. All right, we got uh, Lieutenant Kyle, Nurse Chapel, Lieutenant Sulu, Dr. McCoy, and Lieutenant Uhura. Uhura. What's your, is, so your rare is Uhura. Uhura. Oh, yeah, that's the one with the long range perplex and uh, whatnot, right? Uh, I will take your word on that. <laughs> yes. Yes, it does look Previews good. have occurred re, uh, ahead of this, so there's some knowledge we have. Hey, look, Lieutenant Kyle, all he does is sidestep and TK. How many points is he? His shirt's awfully red. It's 25 points. <laughs> <laughs> all right. For a super rare, it's been pulled. And that is uh, Ashana. Uh, she's 25 points and gives some extra stats to a character who's going to be her training partner. Uh, we also got a Romulan commander, oddly unique. Hmm. I wonder if there's an effect that they have that we'll have to look in that in piece by piece or in our sealed uh, primer. Sorry. Uh, a Tellerite, Ensign Chekhov, and another Klingon back. So, take a good look at that. Uh, you want to keep this together for our sealed there, huh? Uh, yes. Let's <laughs> uh, put that there. <laughs> Alrighty. I am. I have Ron, Romulan Centurion. Okay. A uh, Talosian? Talosian? A Talosian? Uh, Nurse Chapel. Yeoman Rand. Yeoman? Ooh. And the Mirror Verse Uhura. I'm going to butcher all the names on these. <laughs> I figured you guys should know this now. Uh, I didn't watch the original. I started watching Star Trek with Next Generation, so I don't you know, know any of these characters. I have a problem in common with you. I just I'm a little familiar with them because, you know, I, I learned later in life or you know picked up things here and there. So yeah, I'm gonna mispronounce some things too because I'm not a big original series Trekkie. I'm more of a Next Generation Trekkie myself as well. Uh, so there's I know there's Trekkies who are just cringing at every pronunciation. <laughs> We're that I sorry. Have uh, I'm excited though on this pack because Nurse Chapel was followed by a Tribble. Yes! Uh, I also got an Andorian, uh, Korax, who's a Klingon, and Shirtless Kirk! Yes! Shirtless Kirk! <laughs> Ready to axe handle your face in! <laughs> tribbles! Need more Tribbles. Pull Tribbles. So I got a Lokai, a Tolosian. An Andorian, Romulan Legionnaire, and Mr. Spock. The not Mirrorverse Mr. Spock. Oh, okay. Cool. Seems logical. Very <laughs> logical. And that's, that's a that's a Spockism. I know. Logical. <laughs> You're a Spockism. You're you just butchering this right now. <laughs> I apologize on behalf of my wife 
for uh, what we're seeing here. I'm going to hit her with the Gorn Rock. Because we got a Gorn. Uh, along with Lieutenant Leslie, Ensign Chekhov, Lieutenant Kyle, and the Starfleet Security Officer. He's a red shirt. His shirt is very red. You know, oddly enough, so is Lieutenant Kyle. I'm actually pretty sure that he, he has like a trait or a power that says red shirt. Yes. Oh, and the Gorn, ready to kick some butts. They've got really thick dials, and uh, whoever, whichever one of us is going to grab that pack is probably going to want to use it in their seal. Alright, so this is uh, Romulan Centurion, Romulan Lieutenant, the Keeper, who is the same as the Talosian, uh, Klingon Captain, and Koloth. Oh, Koloth, the he's guy holding, holding the triple. Oh, he's holding a triple. It looked like he was holding a brain. Yeah, it's really one confused. of the one of the stories in Star Trek is that the uh, the triples are cause of the fall of the Klingon Empire. <laughs> <laughs> there was a great war with the triples. That's why they get extra stuff against the Klingons. Yeah, why Klingons are the Klingons are extra affected by triples. So it's uh. <laughs> That makes sense. There's an episode of Deep Space Nine where they went back in time and saw it with witnessing things in the original series. And Worf was mentioning things about the triples. Alright, so next up, we've got a Klingon Beck, a Klingon Lieutenant, uh, Dr. McCoy, an Orion female, Green Lady, Careful Kirk. Careful Kirk. Uh, and also an M113 creature. Yes! The coolest creature in this set. I cannot wait. Yes. It combines really well with the undead stuff, I most of yes. realize. Uh, so this has Lieutenant Kyle, Romulan Lieutenant, Lieutenant Sulu, Lieutenant Leslie, and uh, Mugato. <laughs> oh my gosh, its face is so cute. <laughs> <laughs> oh, its face is cute, eh? <laughs> it's, look at its face! It's like a teddy bear with a big it's horn. It's so cute. <laughs> That's a lot of orange. Uh, so it leaps, climbs. It's tough. Oh my it comes in either 60 I'm or 40 confused. points. It's got special attack power. Uh, when Mugato makes a close attack and hits, after resolutions, give the hit target an action token. When Mugato hits a target or a character with two action tokens, damage dealt is penetrating. So he has incapacitated on top of his attacks. <laughs> well, so, yeah, basically it's like it's like incapacitated, but it's not incapacitated. Yeah. So you can't outwit it like incapacitate, but it functions. And he's just so cute. Okay, where did the pack that coal off You go? can go here. That's what I was wondering. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so a lot of really cool stuff that I can't wait to actually kind of dive into. Uh, and uh, so we're gonna we're gonna take all this stuff, we're gonna slap it back in the boxes, we're gonna deal out some sealed action for this. We're going to put together some SEAL teams for the next uh, video, which should be up the same day, or we'll try to get it up for the same day. Um, so that being release day Wednesday. And then on Thursday, we'll be talking about our favorite, or the, the entire set, um, piece by piece. Or uh, not the entire set, but rather everything we got in this brick. Yes. <laughs> All right. Uh, so in the meantime, beat me up, Scotty, and thank you very much, WizKids.